Hello, today I have a book unboxing video. Oh, I went a little bit mad. Basically, someone put in my comment section, check out the book people, Hannah. They do like well-known books, but for cheaper prices, and they do kind of book bundles, and I love book bundles. And I kind of went a bit mad because they had this flash sale thing, and uh, yeah, this happened. So let's begin. Oh my God. Oh. Oh, yes. Okay. This is actually pretty full, this like box. So there's like rubbish, 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 rubbish. Oh my god, I actually can't get it open. It's got, I'll show you, it's got kind of like plastic. So it's all, they're all being held hostage. Okay, so first up, I got this book bundle so there's all the books there and they're all kept together and basically these are called my story and they're set in kind of diary entry form and I have this if I can find it yes they are my story they're by loads of different authors and they're historical things so this is Anne Boleyn and me which I'm currently reading this is set in diary entry form and it's a girl who like works at the places where Anne Boleyn lives so she works where Anne Boleyn lives, Anne Boleyn moves, she has to move with her and it's kind of about the time and our like Anne Boleyn history. I then saw that they had this super cheap. So the people that they have is Berlin Olympics, Egyptian Princess, Highway Girl, To Kill the Queen, Lady Jane Grey, No Way Back, Road to War, Sophie's uh, Secret War, Suffragette, The Hunger. This also isn't the like complete series, there are so many more. There's like one from someone in the Titanic, someone from the plague. There's also one about Anastasia who was part of the Russian royal family and I really really want to get her one. So yeah, I'm excited to get into these. I then got, from the bay, uh, Quentin Blake. This is four books, two the spines, four children's books. Tea for getting involved, it's getting serious. Please open. Yes, Queen. Okay, so I'll just undress the book for you one second, like a book strip tease. And ta da! These are, right, they're Mo Michael Rosen like kind of poetry collections, but they're illustrated by Quentin Blake. Quentin Blake is life and Queen and Bay, and I love him. So this one is Hard Boiled Eggs, it's children picture books. So they're like massive. And they've got full colour, full colour Quentin Blake pictures in them. I love Quentin. So you've got the breakfast book, you've got the doctor book. A girl with all like little spots on her. You've got this one which is the seaside book which looks really cool. It's called Smelly Jelly and Smelly Fish. I really like that drawing at the front. And then I've got this one which is Under the Bed Bedtime Book. And that's really cute as well. I love Quentin Blake and I want to actually like have his whole complete works. And I thought this would be good for a Quentin Blake fan because oh those colour pictures. Next up I got this which I think is super cheap and that's why I got it. It's basically called Violet McCull's Brilliant Plot and it's by Anna Branford and it's basically a little book series um, about this little girl. And that's it. And I just thought, if I'm in a reading slump, these are, look super quick, but also really interesting. So I can just pick them up. Hopefully it'll get me out of the slump. Cool. I'm really trying to read more, like, modern children's fiction, because I only used to read classic children's fiction. I'm trying to get on it. I then got... There's, like, more rubbish. More rubbish. This, which is by Sally Hughes. Now, Sally Hughes's books are quite expensive. They're children's books, and they're children's picture books. And they're just so beautiful, and this was on like a really good offer. So it comes in this little bag, which I will use this bag, super duper cute. And then these are loads of picture books. Oh, I'm gonna have to get scissors. <laughs> Sally, why? Oh my god, there's actually quite a lot of them in here, like loads of different picture books, but the illustrations are just stunning. I wanted to get some Sally Hughes, Sally Hughes stuff because I think she's a fantastic author and illustrator and I just wanted to kind of like support good illustrators like that because I don't like computer generated things I think we should support these good old people and people like Quentin that still use, you know, a paintbrush 
probably there, Sally. And probably when I'm done with Sally's books, is I'll keep the ones that I really like and then give the rest to the charity shops. Whereas with Quentin, I'm just like hoarding. <laughs> I then got a adult book. <laughs> what a surprise! <laughs> of all these. Um, this is The Witch and Her Soul. This is by Christine Middleton and it's like a witch novel. Basically, this is about a woman called Southworth and this is kind of her, supposed to be her diary. Although it doesn't look like it's written in diary entry, it's like in chapter format. Um, she, her husband's really ill, he's dying and she decides to write this like confessional diary thing about her life, about her desires, about the time. Um, and she's, her best friend is someone called Alice who is alleged to be a witch. So it's about that and it's going to be about like her opinions on witches and her opinions of the time and her beliefs and in kind of like a confessional kind of tell-all tale of a witch. Oh. And then last but not least I got this which is, it was super cheap, it's by Caroline Duffy and it's called Miss Scrooge. I really have a problem with this <laughs> and that is that it's white and you might think well this is like white paper so Sally's books, they're white but they're gloss so they're not going to get dirty. Anyway, doesn't matter. Um, this is about Miss Scrooge, that's basically it. It's a Christmas towel, it's illustrated by Posse Simmons. Well, let's have a look at you, Posse Simmons. Ooh, I like your illustrations. Okay, well done. <laughs> yeah, by approval. You can carry on being an illustrator. It's a modern Christmas tale about a woman who lives alone with her cat. Bliss. Recycles, bicep. What's wrong with her then? Oh, the real gifts we give and receive. Me, I, I don't know what's wrong with her. Like, she lives with a cat. Cool. She lives alone. Cool. She recycles. Good person. She eats leftovers from her food. She's not wasting. Why is that, like, Scrooge-esque? And that's it. That's the end of this unboxing video. I hope you enjoyed it. And tell me if you've read any of these books or if you have any you know, interest in reading them. Also, who is your favourite illustrator? Because I really want to find more illustrators that I like and support their work. Because I don't like computer generated stuff, I'm like, well, you should probably do something about it and buy stuff from the people who hand sketch things to say, like, I like them. So tell me who your favourite illustrators are and I'll see you again soon for another video. This is a special moment, guys. I'm going to introduce you to my childhood bear. Um, I actually took him to university with me. I'll always have him. This is him, actually quite big for like a child's bear. Also very, very imaginative name. He is called White Bear. How are you doing? Do you like my, I've got these little pumpkin lights. Do you enjoy it? No? Okay. Oh, oh, you're going. Okay, fine. Guess this song, because if you guess it, you're like amazing. Okay. There is a fine, fine line between a lover and a friend. And there's a fine, fine line between reality and pretend. And you never know till you reach the top. What, what's that from? Because if you know, let me just say I've seen it three times and it's incredible. Waste of your time. And I don't have the time to waste on you anymore. But I'm back.